Uh, this is where we service uh, some of the machines, uh, sell Bandit, uh, as well as uh, All Access, and um, also sell a bunch of uh, gear for Arborists. Uh, so we're doing some planning meetings today. Uh, today is uh, Allegiant Partners, uh, and yesterday we did Allegiant Partners planning. Uh, we did two days of work truck direct planning as well. And I'm here in uh, Portland, Oregon. Uh, this is Work Truck Direct's uh, headquarters, and um, we have a facility here where we sell equipment as well. And um, it's about eight o'clock in the morning uh, here in Portland. All right, everybody, say hi. This is the day in the life of Chris Inbaum. This is the marketing department's idea to say, okay, this is what we do: strategic sales meeting. <laughs> <laughs> This is my little uh, office in San Rafael when I'm in California. This is uh, where I work. Uh, and right now I'm just working on kind of what, um, executing a plan around what we learned last week in our planning meetings for both Work Truck Direct uh, and Allegiant Partners. Um, and we had Scott Wheeler uh, from Wheeler Consulting uh, in on Friday and um, put together a really good presentation on our business um, that he had uh, gathered information based on a bunch of interviews that he did of our a lot of our salespeople and uh, people in the organization and he really told us things that we already knew but it's always good to have somebody from the outside come in and tell you the same things that you think you know uh, and the main thing he told us was, I mean, if you look at our business and the business that in a lot of ways works best for us, which is FedEx, on the one hand, we have customers um, who, when we started the business, we were coming to um, just to ask them if they needed financing, but eventually it got to the point where the equipment was hard to find, so we actually got to the point where um, we were keeping information on where the equipment was, and you've got AP here, and at the point where we're actually bringing the equipment dealer's business uh, and the customers are going to us to figure out uh, where the equipment is, that's really the holy grail because all of a sudden uh, you're not just um, crucial for the customer itself, but you're also crucial to the equipment dealer and you've created a situation where everybody is reliant on us to make the market happen almost. And we're starting to see that um, in Arbor as well. We have a lot more situations now where we have people uh, calling us uh, basically to find equipment um, and what is required um, especially on the sales side is we need to have equipment and industry expertise with our salespeople and the only way really to do that is to have salespeople really focus on usually just one industry at a time. Sorry about that. Anyway, that's uh, what I'm working on. Talk to you soon.